If you remember, I painted them with you on Monday and fun fact, this is kind of a gift from my husband for Christmas. How many rings? These are all of the pendants and the bracelets and the necklaces. Welcome to a new vlog. As you can see, today I had my hair refreshed. I desperately needed to color my roots. It was really, really bad. And I also got just a little bit of the trim, so I'm ready for spring. I really like to have my hair shorter at the front. So that's what we did today. And now we're heading home, and then I can, you know, get ready for the day, show you my outfit. And I also bought something, and I crossed it off my wish list. So I cannot wait to show you that as well. This is my makeup done. Today I went just a little bit more minimal, but now most exciting part that I want to share with you is a new purchase because I crossed something off my wishes. And this is something that I've been searching for more than a year, year and a half, because even last year I was searching for this item. And fun fact, this is kind of a gift from my husband for Christmas because as you know, we gifted each other coupons. And one of the coupons my husband gifted me is that when I find this item, he's gonna purchase it for me. So it's kind of a Christmas gift, even though I found this item in March. You can tell from the little box that it's a jewelry piece. And I think, yeah, everything is kind of falling apart. But I found my gold earrings, ah, which are so, so gorgeous. And this is exactly what I've been looking for. Something that it's not dainty, but also not big. So I can wear them with my gold items in the summer, in the winter. And these are just so, so amazing. I can actually put them on so you can see. I just love how they look. Also up close, I can actually show you the details. Up close, you can see all of the little details. I think this one is a Guess logo because these earrings are from Guess. But then from afar, you don't really necessarily see the details, but I mean, you can still see them, but they're not that obvious, which I love the minimal branding. And at first I thought I was going to go for something sparkly, but then when I was trying things on in the store, comparing, putting them to my ear, I decided to go for something that it's just a little bit more minimal and a little bit more classy. And I mean, these are so gorgeous. I love them so much. They're not too heavy because there was a pair of earrings that I tried on that I felt they were complete thin, but they were just too heavy. And then I had to say to myself, no, I'm not getting them. If they're too heavy, then they are not a thin Kim. Pull yourself together. <laughs> if it's not a 10, think again. This saying really stuck with me. So sometimes I think about it. I'm like, if it's not a 10, think again, which I think it was your favorite as well because it got so many likes. And thank you for the suggestions for the saying. But yeah, I'm so happy I didn't get those because now I got the perfect 10 and I love this so much. And they also are a gift for my husband, which makes them just a little bit more special to wear. And yeah we crossed another item of my wish list. Yay! <laughs> and now this is how the earrings look with my entire outfit. And I'm actually gonna change because when I go to the hairdresser, I always pick sporty tops in case a color or something will drop on them. So I don't stain them. That's something that I always done. So for my outfit of the morning, I wore my black jumper that I bought not too long ago. And then my black skinny jeans. I also had my black Ugg boots and the pink jacket. But now I wanna change my top and also add some accessories and maybe switch out my shoes as well. For my top, I actually wanted to wear something I haven't worn in a while. And I just feel like wearing this one because it's getting just a little bit warmer. And this one, as you can see, it's very sheer. So this is the top that I'm gonna wear today. And then my jeans are gonna stay the same, but I'm also gonna add a belt. And because I'm wearing gold earrings, I'm gonna go for the black belt with a gold buckle, of course. For my jewelry, I'm just gonna add the gold watch to my outfit and also just an extra dainty earring, nothing else, because the top is really busy. And now to the official outfit of the day, this is the top that I decided to wear. 
you can also see the earrings I also have the watch and then for the belt I decided to go without because the buckle didn't really flatter the top and the jeans I prefer to have everything just a little bit more minimal and I love this little line down the middle it's just so so nice so this is obviously my inner layer as always. Also for my nails, if you remember, I painted them with you on Monday and I wanted to show you how well they're holding up because today is Thursday. So this is four days of just regular nail polish and that's why I love Zoya. I'm not sponsored or anything, but just I genuinely love how well they're holding up. If I show you the other hand, both of them are amazing no chipping nothing just slightly wear at the edges but that's pretty much it i love it and then for the outerwear of course i'm wearing the black wool coat because it goes so nicely with the top and with the silk color i love the combo then i also have my black sign bag because i'm gonna be running some errands today and i need to have some space in my bag and then for my shoes i decided to wear my ugg boots because i want to be really comfy i'm gonna be on my feet a lot today and also because i'm wearing a sheer top that is just a little bit colder i'm gonna bring the warmth in with my shoes and ugg boots are very very warm so this is my final outfit of the day and now i also wanted to show you bali's haircut for spring yes oh he loves the massage i hope you don't mind the view <laughs> he's just enjoying the massage but he, as you can see his hair is much much shorter which maybe is just a little bit too short at the moment but it's gonna grow very very soon As you can probably tell from the dog we are at my mom's house and first i wanted to quickly show you outfit of the day before i take everything off and because it's a little bit warmer today yesterday it was so so windy i'm wearing the faux fur coat because this is the warmest coat that i currently have in my wardrobe but then i also paired it with my vest which you can see the little hoodie at the back and also you can see the vest right here as for my shoes i decided to wear my beige combat boots because they're so so comfy and so warm and they also match with my white button up because this is something that i'm wearing underneath and then i also have just a pair of black leggings because we're going to be decluttering today so i want it to be really comfortable and then of course i have my black pulling bag because it's so spacious and i needed to take a lot of things with me so this is my outfit and now we can also show you my mom here is my mom in the background and like i said we're gonna be decluttering today so she's also very very comfy and we're planning to do jewelry and then also shoes we're gonna see if we have enough time but you know at least we're gonna declutter something which i'm so so excited about then i also wanted to quickly show you my nails because like i said i painted them on monday today's sunday and this is how they're looking they're not too bad considering for how long i had them so this is my left hand and then the right hand is a lot more chipped because I am right-handed, so this is how the nail polish is holding up, in case you're curious. As always, we sorted everything in categories. Here are all of her earrings. Then here we have her necklaces. We have some charms for the bracelet, her rings. And then, I'm not sure how you call this, you put them on the necklace pendants, they are all in here. Then we also have the bracelets and the watches and here she has extra boxes and some hair products. But so far she decluttered all of these boxes. This is what she's gonna keep. And now we're gonna continue with the categories. She's done a really amazing job this is her key pile on this side and this is everything she's gonna declutter some things are gold so we're gonna sell them and maybe she's gonna get something she's gonna love and yeah i think this is so so amazing look how many rings these are all of the pendants and the bracelets and the necklaces amazing this is everything she's keeping and then we left the hardest pile for last these are all of her earrings which we're gonna do now Thank you. 
This is everything she's decluttering with her earrings. She's done such an amazing job. And these are the earrings that she's gonna keep with the exception of this pile because these are maybe earrings which she's gonna try on and possibly declutter even more. And now we sorted through every single earring and this is everything she's keeping. We also went through the other jewelry. This is the pile that I'm gonna try on. This is everything she's gonna sell. Gold, silver, anything that might be valuable. So this is amazing. These are trash because there are a lot of earrings that we cannot salvage. And this is everything she's gonna gift away to friends. And she's done such an amazing job. But now our plan is to clean some earrings and then we're gonna reorganize them in her jewelry box. This is everything that I'm gonna try actually with you because there are some things I can actually take with me. This is her travel box, which she used for jewelry, but now that she doesn't have that many items anymore, she's gonna put it with her other travel stuff. And now for the final result, she has stackers, which is actually a gift from me, I don't know how many Christmases ago. But what we've done is this. Here are all of her earrings, which we cleaned. Here is her bracelet. These are the necklaces, here are the two watches, which maybe you remember them. And then here she has her necklaces and the charms. Then the layer underneath are all of her earrings. We used my system, so we have rose gold, we have gold, silver, pearls and colorful items and then white pearls. So everything is color coordinated. And then she actually has this section completely free. So she wanted to put her boxes in here because she wants to keep them and that's fine. These are empty, nothing special. And then we just added a pair of her sunglasses. And now the last thing to do is to find the space for her box. This is where we decided to put everything because she has a little mirror in here. And then she also has the little tray for her most worn items. And then we also reorganized everything because it couldn't really close because of the rings, they were really high. So we put her most worn earrings in here. And then her rings are in the front part of this section, which actually makes more sense because she wears earrings a lot more than rings. And this is absolutely perfect. And when she had this storage before, it's actually in this drawer. So we created a lot more space and this just feels so much better. But now, lastly, I wanna go through some pieces and see if I wanna take anything with me. Here are the earrings, which I think I'm gonna take with me. I think these are really, really classic and fun. But for the necklace, I don't really think this is my style, so I'm gonna leave it. And then here we have really, really dainty and fun earrings. These are actually gold with a little bit of a white and pink crystals, which I'm actually gonna take as well because this can be perfect for the beach with my bathing suits and these are gold. So they should be fine even if I'm swimming in them. Um, I think we have a problem. I'm gonna take so much jewelry with me today. But on my left, I have the dark pearl earrings, which this is not something that I love. But then on the right side, I'm not sure how to show you, but these are much smaller and these are so nice and dainty. So I'm gonna take the small little dark pearls with me. And here we go again, another pair of earrings I'm gonna take with me today, which for me, I'm gonna take this and then I'm gonna see how much I wear them. I can always give them back to her or give them to someone else, but these are iridescent and they're so nice and sparkly. And yeah, how many earrings do I have so far? Four pairs of earrings, oh my God. <laughs> and then I have this silver earrings, which I thought they're gonna be perfect for maybe swimming again because I love wearing jewelry with my bathing suit, but they are not sparkly enough for my taste. You can see they're an a really nice classic earring, but they're just not a 10 for me. But now these sparkly earrings, I just might take with me. <laughs> 
I'm in trouble. But like I said, I think for summer, I've noticed that I don't have earrings that I feel comfortable swimming in. But this, I feel this could be really fun. They're kind of rose gold, just a little bit sparkly. And like I said, if I don't end up wearing them a lot, I can always declutter them and, you know, we're not losing anything if I take them home. And here are the final earrings. These are really nice. These are rose gold and it's like a little, what is it called? It has four little petals. Kaj tole? A detalca. Kako so detalci reče po angliš, kaljaš? Klaver. Ah, okay. It's a really nice and sparkly, but honestly, I am already taking so many earrings with me. I'm gonna leave this here. So I had a few minutes to think because I feel this is a little bit excessive. Even though it feels like free jewelry, I have to be realistic. So what I'm gonna take with me are these earrings because I really want to try them and see how much I wear them. I'm also gonna take the silver ones because they're super fun. And I'm gonna also take the swimming earrings, like I said before. <laughs> These are now the official name, swimming earrings. But then for these earrings, I'm actually gonna leave them here because even though I wanted the black pearl for a while, would I buy this in store? Not really. So I'm not gonna take this. And then this I'm gonna take, but as my extra earring, because it can be really fun for that, even though they're a pair, I'm just gonna wear one at a time, which I think it's a little bit more appropriate for my jewelry collection. So this is what is going with me and this is what I'm gonna leave here. And now we are on our way back. I really hope you enjoyed the declutter. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you come to this point, maybe you can leave an emoji of a ring. Maybe that would work <laughs> with the theme of this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.